mags on both, correct frequency. So, brake to flight, brake off. Free rotate gauge, 2000 motor RPM. Adding power to bring that back. Holding 2000 while the belt is slipping. going to come up quite soon there it goes, stick forward to catch it quite just above the surface, ground effect 60, climb away, a little bit of forward trim. Bearing back, crossing the end of the runway at about 400 feet, given it's only 520 metres long, it's pretty good. Traffic off Romeo Oscar's departing west towards Beeston, changing to Liverpool on 9855 Ashcroft. Pardon radar, good morning, Golf Uniform India Romeo Oscar, request basic service. Golf Uniform India Romeo Oscar, hard and uh, tower on the radar for easy, stand by one. Golf Uniform India Romeo Oscar, hard and uh, very good morning to you, Kenny, 1031. Go for me, Oscar. Go ahead, go for me, Oscar. The track further to the west across the high ground, then start to do your kidnapping case, I would suggest London 2, 1, 2, 4, 7, 5, 0. Thank you, uh, in fact, barely readable now, so uh, I'll go over to London 124750 and score 7000. Thanks for the uh, service, go for me, Oscar. Go for me, Oscar, you're all welcome, and have a good trip. We'll see you later. So some of these smaller turbines here, you do have to be careful, they are pointing 180 degrees away from the wind, the wind is coming from behind us, so it's going through them and turning them that way. Now the larger ones, like ahead, are pointing into wind. So if you're using wind turbines to give you the wind direction in the event of an engine out force landing, you've got to be careful because you could get it 180 degrees wrong if you rely on the smaller ones, but not all the smaller ones are like that, so it is tricky. So I'm heading west and I know the wind is easterly, and these are all pointing towards the east. It's not really ideal overflying these fairly low down, they could be giving some significant updraft. Right, right, right. This is Clint Brennick, where we get our water from, and even though it's been um, extremely dry through April, it's good to see this is very full. an hour went over beyond which is great fun to fly down the low. Might well do that on the way back. Interesting localised currents on Clenalwyn. It's not so much pure easterly. Maybe the terrain is causing the wind to change direction. Great driving roads here. 
I have myself on order an Aerial Anthem 4, if you know what one of those is. Um, two and a half years ago, I placed my order. So, massive demand and COVID have extended the, uh, the lead time. So, that's due to arrive. It's in build at the moment. It's due to arrive in the next uh, couple of months or so. Just in time for summer. And I think this road looks like I might have to come and uh, drive very gently on get magnificent. And this whole area here and I always get picked up by Welsh speakers when I attempt to pronounce I don't know how you pronounce this Minithalithog I don't know but it's a big moor all around um, Clinbrenning and Clinarwen and it's, it's very bleak but I like it it's very picturesque so we're looking directly at Snowden now 12 o'clock position Trifan is off to about 1 o'clock to the right of Snowden and it is um, Sunday, so with that in mind, the military should not be flying today. That would be absolutely certain. It's quite chilly actually up here. Roads ahead temperatures drop to 6.9. So getting wind chill as well. So it's fairly sheltered in the front, particularly for flight and balance. I am wearing uh, four layers. Thought would be enough. I'm wearing my summer flying suit though, I probably should have gone winter. I could have used my heating jacket. I do have heating gloves. Having said all that, the sun is out and at the moment I'm flying away from it so it's not really warming us up that much. It will warm us up more on the way back. So that basically I've got an 11 knot tailwind. So that's going to be a 22 knot net difference in my speed. So I expect to cross the ground on the way back in the mid 50s. Currently doing high 70s. That will take a lot longer. But we're not in a hurry. Sometimes it does feel very surreal being up here. 2,900 feet altitude. Pointing directly at Snowden. With not much around me. That's what gives you the great view, but I know it's not for everybody. But on a day like today, it certainly is for me. Well, there aren't many views that get better than that out of an aircraft, in my view. No lights coming on, just in case there's anybody else doing what I'm doing. starts down here. I'm just trying to read the topography. So the wind is coming from behind me. It's going to bowl up there and cause some turbulence at the top, which I don't like. So I'm just going to come round here a little bit, where the land is lower, so my separation will be greater. Heading at the moment towards the Riddu car park. Let's go and fly around the bowl. Never done this before. I've only flown over it many times, but this is a different view. Oh, a bike's going down the Snowden Ranger path over to the left.
Awesome. get some bumps here. It's going to slightly reduce power. But also get a lot of ridge lift.
pretty good. Very enjoyable flight. Slight case of the heebies going over snow. It really wasn't too bad at all. That's when they'll have not wind. I wouldn't want to do much more than that though. I don't really know why it is. It's well, I, I, I do. It's logical, isn't it? Really, when you're hanging from a bolt, 4,000 feet in the air, being thrown around by varying winds. You know, it, it, um, it's not really natural, is it, I guess? And I'm certainly a lot more used to it used to be. I mean, I, when, it's, when we're quite low, like now, I absolutely love it. But, I mean, you know, this is quite high enough to end badly if anything went wrong. Um, it's not a huge difference between this and 4,000. It would just take longer at 4,000, wouldn't it, to be honest? Um, but, I don't know, it just feels different. I think I'll try a um, glider bridge today. I haven't done one for a while. Good to keep me in practice. I've been getting a little bit lazy doing the easier powered approaches. Hey, power back to idle. So, is he going to make that? So, we'll do one S turn.
much where I wanted to be.